has treated let's do this question in this question sample size n1 equal to n2 equal to 57 then x bar equal to 15406 y bar equal to 16220 then s1 equal to 7631 s2 equal to 9187 and here consider one for woman and two for men so here the null hypothesis becomes h0 such that mu1 equal to mu2 against the alternative hypothesis h1 such that mu1 is greater than mu2 and the formula for test statistic becomes test statistic t equal to x bar minus y bar minus of mu1 minus mu2 divided by s into square root of 1 upon n1 plus 1 upon n2 and s square equal to n1 into s1 square plus n2 into s2 square divided by n1 plus n2 minus 2 so first we calculate the value of s square equal to 57 into 7631 bracket square plus 57 into 9187 bracket square divided by 57 plus 57 minus 2 equal to 7259075.09 therefore s equal to 8519.9809 now put the values then we get test statistic t equal to 15406 minus 16220 divided by 8519.9809 into square root of 1 upon 57 plus 1 upon 57 equal to minus 840 divided by 1594.940 equal to minus 0 0.5103 and here degrees of freedom equal to degrees of freedom equal to n1 plus n2 minus 2 equal to 57 plus 57 minus 2 equal to 112 and the corresponding p value p value equal to 0 0.3055 therefore we get the null hypothesis h0 such that mu1 equal to mu2 against the alternative hypothesis h1 such that mu1 is greater than mu2 then the statistic t equal to minus 0 0.5103 then degrees of freedom equal to 112 and corresponding p value equal to 0 0.3055 I hope you find that helpful. Thank you.